45 15. <laughs> That'll adjust in a second. That's so funny as hell. Fuck your candle, all you get is wick. Well, that was interesting. Multiple, multiple failures to regain the 20 and 25 level where call interest was strongest. Uh, three so far today. Obviously, we'll see where positioning shakes out overnight, and they, they slammed the VIX without, without really getting it anywhere. Um, I mean, I still think ultimately 45-35 is the goal, right? But, uh, or well, gamma neutral, where, wherever that's moved today. Probably a little closer to the money. It's probably at like 45-30 now. Um... Futures had a pretty hard time pulling up above forty five twenty almost all day. So yeah, I mean I mean futures futures just kind of chopped back and forth across forty five twenty ever since this morning. This is this is the this is like the confirmation point for the double bottom breakout, right? So I mean we closed above it, which is you know, technically bullish, but the triple top rejection across today might not be so bullish going into the end of this week. Um, and I do expect that with worsening data, uh, non-farm unemployment PCE over the next two days that we may, we may start to see some downside given that they've so far failed to break GN. That means VIX remains sensitive and the MM is still selling into falling prices. And since there isn't enough liquidity for the bulls to push up much higher um they may fail and if they do you know we're going to be looking to the well obviously the 4520 level initially but 4500 and 4490 are going to be very important downside confirmation levels uh tonight bank of japan is going to be speaking on their forward monetary policy or establishment of a more modern monetary policy Depending on how that speech goes, I mean, the rumor of the rumor of Japan moving up their you know yield curve dropped the market a hundred BPS last time. Um, so the news of them potentially instating a, a a positive central bank rate would be significantly more bearish for anybody currently caught in the uh, in the yen dollar carry trade, and if they feel that especially after their consumer confidence was down today, if they feel that uh, establishing a, a positive central bank rate is going to push them towards their target of 2% inflation, um, they're going to they're gonna take advantage of that. Can the bulls pump through that kind of Japan news? And the bulls couldn't pump through fucking gamma neutral, despite having little to no upside resistance today. There's no liquidity, right? This, this, all of this pumping shit only works because, well, for two reasons, right? Either you're above gamma neutral and the market makers buying the dip, right? Or you have short calls that you can squeeze out, except this time all of the short call interest was between like 4460 and 4480. And they squeezed that out yesterday and all they, they didn't really even squeeze them out. They just, they just rolled their positions up to like 44.25 to 44.50. The only thing propping them up today is probably tomorrow's collar. And when that rolls off, there's no more positive like charm flows from that, right? And so the support at 4,500 vanishes. Um, I, I, don't, I don't think that's good for them. I mean, there's no one to squeeze. There's no one to buy the dip except them. It's 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 too much to hold up with you know zero DTE leverage, and then you know nobody's confident in the market right now, right? There's no bullish news. Earnings are over and they were lackluster. Growth is down. Project uh, projected it's down almost half a percent, right? There weren't buyers up there a month ago. Nothing changed. Yeah, this is just worse than a month ago. So up, got it. I believe what you want, but. It's not looking good for them. They had their shot, and they, they kind of fucked it up. The VIX shorting is getting out of hand, though. I mean, it just creates more Vega risk though if the market slips, right? VIX shorting's getting out of hand. Just check it in. End of day here. How did VIX get smashed? Uh, I mean, they were trying to 
They were trying to get their 4520s in the money. They, they were not successful. So they sold even more puts today after de-risking to pump more. They needed above GN. Otherwise, de-risking is going to just tank the market back to 4400. They need the market maker to buy the dip, right? So you you can't really you can't really de-risk effectively unless you get it back above gamma neutral. They didn't do that today. I mean, they they may still try tomorrow, but they failed today. And now tomorrow, you know, they've got another unknown to deal with. The MM doesn't give a shit, right? They just they just want to make their money on the spreads and arbitrage. All right. Uh, once we get options data in, I'll have updates out later tonight, probably mm, a little later into the Asian session. Depending on if I'm home in time. Otherwise, even later than that. Thank you guys so much for tuning in, and I will see you tomorrow morning. Have a great night, everybody. Later.